The Hawaii pilgrimage to honor St. Damien involved transporting 600 people to Europe and back. On tonight's Mixed Plate, the special care given to the 11 patients of Kalapapa and Hale Mohalo. Moving hundreds of people is a chore in itself. Add 11 elderly, disabled travelers, and you've got a task of Herculean proportions. Many of the streets of Europe are cobblestoned, not an easy ride for wheelchairs, and the absence of ramps confined most patients to the main thoroughfares. They're tired because it's been many, many long days in a row, but everything that they've done has been something that they would have wanted to do. So they've chosen every day to do it all. And when you have patients in their 70s and uh, 80s, it's difficult to keep going at that pace. The biggest challenge? Fatigue. Nearly two weeks on the road. No more ice, no more poi. The patients and their caregivers had activities and appearances every day, many in the cold of Belgium. It is so cold here. And the heat of Rome. Awaiting entry into St. Peter's for the canonization, they were very nearly trampled by nuns on the run. From quiet Kalopapa, they were thrust in front of cameras and curious onlookers, but none would have missed this trip. Nice to see this, you know, a special place where we never be seen. It's just like a big world we are in. Would they do it again? They just might. The planning for the last year and a half, now it's over and it's just, it's like exciting. It's, I think we're gonna take a big deep breath. <laughs> and there might be another one? I hope so, <laughs> Madame Marianne. That's mixed plate. Hopefully not too soon. Yeah, uh, by the way, I just, but wanna, that would be a big just wanna pat you on the back for you really a great job you and Thanks. Rex well, Van Arnswald did. Rex uh, yeah. just worked so what was hard the, for, for you, what was the highlight of this pilgrimage for you? Um, you mean besides coming home? <laughs> yes, after <laughs> no, a long I, two-week I trip, think yeah. it was wonderful being in uh, St. Peter's Basilica and uh -huh. actually watching the faces of the patients as they first saw it and, uh -huh. and many of the people in the Hawaii pilgrimage because, um, I mean, just being in the Vatican, you have to go to the Vatican at least once in your life. There's just nothing like it. Mm -hmm. um, and, it and it was wonderful that, uh, that Damien was uh, canonized yeah. in such a grand place. Well, it was wonderful work. Thanks again. Thank you.